A tigered couple is suing the company that handled their pet's cremation. They claim they received the wrong paw imprints as well as a questionable amount of ashes. So let's get to Fox 12's Zach Anders, who met with this couple this afternoon and explains the lawsuit. Zach? Yeah, that's right. Diane and Leland Smith, they love their two ba beagles, Bailey and Dixie. And when the oldest 13-year-old Bailey passed away in September, it was a difficult loss, made worse when younger Dixie developed a neurological issue. She was only four years old and had to be put down last month. They went to the same company for both pets cremations, but something seemed off. The Smiths relied on dignified pet services in Tualatin for cremation of both their dogs. They said they bought the same package and expected the same service, but for animals of the same breed and roughly the same size, they claim something didn't seem right. The service that we were provided previously for our little girl Bailey it was good. It was it was a good experience, which is why we chose them again. Um, this time, this time it was not. The couple says they paid four hundred and thirty dollars to have Dixie euthanized in their home, then privately cremated. But take a look at the containers they got back, both filled to the top with ashes, Bailey in the larger tin and Dixie in the smaller one. If we have Dixie's ashes, then where's Bailey? If, you know, that's, I that's mean. The, the, the converse <laughs> portion of that is that if if those are Dixie's ashes, then where's the rest of Bailey? What I'm trying to reconcile is the fact that both of them were the same breed and both of them were, were within, you know, four or five pounds of each other. So how much of a difference would it really make? The Smiths also paid for a clay paw imprint like they had done before with Bailey. Instead, they say they got back paw prints of Dixie inked on paper. They say the company told them a staff member marked the wrong option before cremation a mistake they can't get back. Leland says they were expecting an apology, but instead got excuses. And then it was, it was just, it was insult upon injury to have them treat us the way they did afterward, that, that we were wrong or, or we were the guilty party. Now the couple are suing for $10,000. They say it's not for the money, but to make sure it doesn't happen again. We've never sued anyone, and frankly, um, the thought of suing anyone was the furthest thing from my mind. Um, I just wanted accountability. I just wanted them to say, we messed up, we're sorry. The company responded to us yesterday by saying, Private cremation for the pet was in question was most certainly honored, but that they couldn't comment further on pending litigation. The Smiths say ultimately they just want to know if people are getting back the correct remains and all of it. Reporting live in studio, Zach Anders, Fox 12 Oregon.